We are here with hot developments of the day. Ukrainian forces hit Russian positions. Don't forget to like the video before moving on to details. Security service of Ukraine exposed a Russian accomplice. While conducting counter-sabotage measures in Vinci Oblast, security service of Ukraine exposed a Russian accomplice. She was caught while trying to flee abroad. The detainee was a resident of Berislav, Kherson Oblast, who had actively cooperated with the local occupation administration after the capture of the Ukrainian city. According to the investigation, from March to August 2022, when Kherson Oblast had been occupied by Russian troops, the suspect sided with the Russians and voluntarily assisted the Russian armed forces and the Russian administration. The SSU has established that she passed the list of veterans of Russia-Ukraine war and other citizens who could potentially resist the Russian soldiers to the Russian-created military commandant's office. Russians used the information to conduct mass raids on the homes of local residents and abductions of people, the Secret Service noted. The victims were required to confess to fabricated cases. In cases of refusal, the Russians used torture and threatened to kill them. In addition, the collaborator helped Russians navigating the terrain and indicated the shortest routes to the settlements of Berislav district for its capture. She also assisted in the quartering of Russian units in the houses of Ukrainians, who left for the Ukrainian-controlled territory. Another news has been received today. According to breaking news, Ukrainian forces hit Russian positions. It has been reported that earlier today, Ukrainian armed forces hit Russian positions in Skadovsk. The information in question has been received from the Ukrainian news pages on the Twitter accounts. What is your opinion on this matter? You can express your thoughts in the comments. Do not forget to subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications for more breaking news. We will be back with new developments.